Hi guys, we went out and found the best places where you can have a meal and a drink for under 10 quid So you don't have to, but you will want to, so we will do it anyway Right now we are kind of just off Royal Mile, that way And the first place we visited is called Oink And it's a place that basically every day just has like a big roast pig And you can get a pulled pork sandwich. Those sandwiches come in three different sizes. They come from the tiniest little piglet to the biggest one which is called I think the grunter and the tiniest one is actually only three pounds. The biggest one I think about five pounds or 550. So there you can absolutely fit under 10 pounds. Easy. We both had a piglet and I had a coffee so like mine was basically for 460 for a coffee and a piglet. There you go. They have one location here on Royal Mile, kind of on the bottom part of it, uh, next to the Parliament, and one on Victoria Street. Next up in a similar area is Wings, everyone's favorite. If you're slightly nerdy, you might have been to Wings already if you live here. They do have different themed tables there, so like one of them is just like Star Trek themed, which is great. That's my favorite. Uh, they also have some old school gaming consoles and things like that. And also you can sit down in their little underground lair room and watch Sharknado. But apart from all those great things, you can also eat wings. They are all 420 per bowl of six. Uh, they come in many, many, many different varieties. You have like dry rubbed ones. They also sell ones with like boozy toppings. So like kind of like tequila-y, uh, limey, salty ones. Then they have ones with spicy sauces, ones with mild sauces, so everyone will pick something as long as you don't mind that your main meal is deep fried wings because you're not getting anything else. They also have some really affordable beer, so basically if you get two bowls of chicken, uh, that's 8.40 uh, and then on top of that you get a bottle of salt, which I believe is two pounds, then you're just over 10 pounds. Cheap! Next up, we're gonna get into the subcategory of some Asian eats. Uh, the first place is Maki and Ramen, which is our favorite ramen bar here in Edinburgh. Uh, it, it's very, very like actual Japanese style. They don't really do much else there but ramen. There's a couple of things. They have like a couple of sides and some some yakitori skewers and like I, I think that you can get like a katsu curry but I really recommend you stick to the ramen they have about six or seven kinds two of them are a bit more expensive than 10 pounds those are like the specials but most of them are under nine and they do have free drinks not all of them uh, they do have free water and free tea but you can drink all the tea you want which is very Japanese of them I love it My last tip is gonna be Kebab Mahal, which is one of the first ever places I went to when I moved to Edinburgh, so it holds a special place in my heart. Uh, it's been open since 1979, and since then it has won multiple awards for like the best takeaway curry. You can go there or call them and get a takeaway, but you can also sit in, which is not something most takeaway curry places do. Uh, they do have like five or six tables, and usually um, they're pretty easy to get even on weekends so you know as long as you're not there at like 7 to 9 p.m. you should be able to just pop in and have a nice cheap ish meal uh, the curries run between like 7 and 9 pounds some of them are biryani so they already come with rice and you don't have to buy anything on top of them um, otherwise you can get one for like 750 and then rice or a naan for two pounds on top of that, the naan is humongous, so if you come in two people, you can absolutely share the naan and then you save yourself money for the extra drink. Drinks are pretty affordable too. You can get their house chai for I think 115 or even a glass of mango lassi for 115 as well. And that's it. Uh, hopefully you will enjoy all of these places if you visit Edinburgh and if you find any more, let us know in the comments below. Until then, I guess we'll see you soon. Either here on our channel or maybe in one of those places. 
where we come to eat very often because we have no money. <laughs> okay, guys, we'll see you later. Bye.